The Center for Disease Control and Prevention is now investigating illnesses linked to injections of botulinum toxin, or more commonly known as Botox. All new at 10, 5 News anchor Darren Bob spoke to a local dermatologist to find out how serious this really is. The CDC and the FDA say the injections were administered in non-medical settings like Botox parties at homes or cosmetic spas. Dr. Sandy Johnson of Johnson Dermatology in Fort Smith says that's your first mistake. You should only go to get injections of Botox or filler by a trained core physician or practice. And so go to your dermatologist, go to your plastic surgeon, go to somebody with experience. 19 people in nine states develop very severe complications from injections from what the CDC is calling counterfeit fillers. Two people developed blurred or double vision, facial drooping, and had difficulty breathing after these injections. Dr. Johnson says, do your homework. People to ask three questions. One, is your injector licensed um, in your state to practice medicine? Because injection of fillers and Botox are a medical procedure. Two, how long have they been doing it and what is their training? And then three, are you in a licensed facility? Bottom line, Dr. Johnson says Botox injections or fillers are still very safe. Botox with the proper products and the proper hands is safe and effective. In Fort Smith covering news where you live, I'm Darren Bob, 5 News.